let's talk a little about motivation and, and where, where you are right now. It's really, really easy after a couple of weeks and potentially an assignment and a test that maybe didn't make you feel fantastic to feel like this might be hopeless. I want to encourage you to remember that your studying is a journey. It's not a switch. Uh, when you study something, it's not an on-off. I either know it or I don't, and I either get it right the first time or I don't. It's a journey, and every step that you take is a step closer to, to success. It's really hard to remember that. It's really hard to feel that. But I encourage you, when you're studying, to write a little post-it note for yourself with a line, a little timeline of a journey. And every time you do a question, it creates a little hop on your timeline. I'm a little bit further, I'm a little bit further, I'm a little bit further. And slowly you start seeing that gap between where you are and, and where you want to be. You start seeing that decrease and you start seeing that come down and that's motivating so if you're sitting where you are now and you go I'm not able to do this now change that <laughs> I'm not able to do this yet you know I can't do this change that to I can't do this yet but I'm going to <laughs> tomorrow the next day the next day every time I work at it I'm going to do a little bit more I'm going to do a little bit better and if you're not feeling good about it that's okay it's very hard to feel good about something that we suck at but that doesn't mean that you're going to suck at it forever. So, you know, if you're feeling bad about how you're feeling or how your studies are going, don't let that govern what you do. Don't let that impact um, your feelings of your capability of doing this. You can do this. Uh, you will do this. You, just have, you have to keep putting one step in front of the other. And, you know, on your timeline from knowing nothing to writing the exam, sure, you may be over here right now. But every time you study, you're hopping further and further. So write a little timeline out for yourself and realize that this is a journey. Um, you know, it's not a switch. It's not on off. Not knowing something now doesn't mean that you'll never know it. It will be worth it. Hang in there. Keep going. There are millions of other people who've been where you are and somehow still managed to make it. So just don't give up. And what you don't know, you don't know yet.